Hey guys, it's been a week. And you know what? The puppies have changed a lot. Their eyes are opening now. Look, they're starting to open so they can see and their ears are opening and they're gonna start to crawl around and move. And they're certainly getting bigger. We had to give them their first set of medicine. It's called dewormers. It's just medicine that they have to drink. It tastes not too bad, so they don't mind it, but it just makes sure that they don't have any parasites. And they have to get that several times. I'm gonna answer some of the questions that you guys had. How does the mommy know those puppies are her babies? She can tell by the way that they smell. That's how she knows that they're her babies. She remembers how each one of them smells. How do they get out of their mommy's tummy? Uh, well, they were in there for about 60 days and then when she goes into what's called labor, they come out and the mama cleans them and takes care of them for the next two months. What if they get lost? Well, they pretty much don't get lost. They don't move a whole lot, so they can't really go anywhere. And as you can see, they're in a box. So they can't walk out, not at least until they're quite a bit bigger. So they're not gonna get lost. Somebody's wiggling in there. Do they all eat from the mommy at the same time? Pretty much, sometimes they push and shove and somebody gets some and somebody doesn't. Sometimes they take turns, sometimes they all eat at the same time. Do they get to run around the farm? Not yet, they don't even really walk yet. But as they get bigger, they'll explore more and more and you guys will get to see it because each time you'll see that they're moving a little bit more. Are there horses or ducks on the farm for them to play with? Actually, we do have horses. We have miniature horses and we have big horses. We don't have any ducks, but we've got turkeys and chickens and geese. Um, they'll get to see some of them, probably not run around with them because the dogs tend to want to eat the turkeys and the chickens and the geese, but they usually get along pretty well with the horses. Does the mommy wash her tongue before she cleans them? Nope, that's how she cleans them. She just keeps licking and licking and licking and they get all clean and then she goes on to the next one. I'm glad people don't have to wash each other like that, oof. Do they get squished when they sleep in a pile? Nope, there's a phrase called dog pile. And the reason people use that term is because you see how they are? That's how dogs sleep. And actually, as they get bigger, they will get more and more on top of each other. Right now, they tend to just pile next to each other. As they get older, they'll really start to sleep literally one on top of another. How do the babies know they are brothers and sisters? Again, they know by the smell. Dogs, the first thing they can do when they're born is smell. They can't see and they can't hear. All they can do is smell. So they have really good noses. Oh, that one's got the hiccups. And the last question was, do they have cousins? Well, I guess they do. It depends upon how you think about it, but we have other dogs here that have similar relatives. So I guess in the doggy world, they do have cousins and nieces and nephews. Did you hear that? So it looks like they're all pretty tired. Yeah, see? So next week, I bet they'll be walking around a lot more. So come up with some more questions and we'll talk to you guys next week. Bye-bye.